in Madrid and some interesting changes are made by Zinedine Zidane as the A-bar come to the Spanish capital. Most notable of which I would say, Geiska, is Isco making his first start since the UEFA Super Cup win over Sevilla. So first league start this season. How much is this a boost for him? With Ande Kappa. Decent cross and the header's in. What a start for Abar. Fran Rico. Seemed to go right through Keylor Navas. And Abar scored their first ever La Liga goal against Real Madrid. Well, it's his first goal of the season and he's asking people. I, I'd like to see that again, Kevin. I think he could have done better than that, Keylor Navas. I'm not taking anything away from Fran Rico. Super cross from Kappa, Jerry. It's fantastic cross, but Kevin, it's a very lackadaisical start for Melbourne. Look at the many players in the box, and he's got a free header. He can't get into the box and have a free header like that. He's got acres of space. Downward header, I don't know. I think it's close enough that the keeper could have done better than that. That's awful goalkeeping. I think he should have done much better. In his arm, and he got penalised for it, Kevin. But, you know, it was a one-on-one -on -one situation, which shouldn't be happening again. At sloppy defending, but like the combination play between Isco and, and Gareth Bale earlier, not Cristiano Ronaldo. Finds room for the cross, and there's Bale! Real Madrid level. It's a Ronaldo Bale combination, and that's a 50th La Liga goal for Gareth Bale. Well, great combination, super play from Ronaldo on the left hand side. Massive contribution, clever little step over, but when he goes past him and he holds it up at the far post, Kevin, he's so good in the arc, Gareth Bale. You put a ball like that at the far post, he's going to win it, even against a decent header of the ball, but look at that, he, it's a mismatch, he's up, he's two feet above everybody, just pushes it down into the back of the net, no chance for the keeper, and they're back on level terms. Now maybe they can get themselves going. Reyes go. I think it goes through his legs in the end, he comes across to try and block it, but to no avail. And that's more like Cristiano, that'll give him a bit of belief and confidence. Look how high he is above everybody else. He's finding a few extra seconds here, but now draws the whistle to his mouth, and they're celebrating this like a win. Jose Luis Mendilibar and Eibar and Zidane. Looks at a fourth straight draw, three in a row in La Liga. First time in over seven years that Real Madrid have gone four or more games without a win. And the inquests have probably already started. They don't go back to the top of the table. For now, Atletico Madrid stay in pole position. And it's finished at a shocked Santiago Bernabeu. Real Madrid won, Eibar won.